sing the Bonnet song. God is waiting all day long. This is the Bonnet song. <laughs> people welcome back to the channel if you are new here this is be real with bun where we keep everything real okay so this vlog is going to pretty much be about brazi uh, my baby girl she is nine months and she is having a tongue tie surgery tomorrow she is having her um first surgery tomorrow which is a tongue tie surgery you don't know what a tongue tie is it's basically when your baby has a short tongue um and it can either affect their feeding and their speech so if it is affecting their feeding, then they would do like an emergency tongue tie surgery. But in her situation, she's feeding just fine. She's gaining her weight, so she doesn't need that. So um, the doctor decided to wait till she turned nine months, which she is, to do the surgery. And that is tomorrow. So the thing that I don't like about this surgery is that she can't eat or drink anything after 12 o'clock tonight. And I'm like, she's nine months. Like, nine months. But anyway, so, of course, I'm going to follow their orders because we don't know. You know, I don't want anything to happen on my end because I gave her anything. Um, you know, because I did not listen to them that something happens and I wouldn't be able to live with that. So, I'm not going to give her anything. I'm just going to feed her as much as I can so she won't be hungry throughout the night. Or, you know, whatever the case may be. Because she does like to latch on through the night she don't want her pacifier she wants to be latched on she don't even want the milk she just want to be latched on like i don't know what's wrong with my baby but i don't know she's just extra but anyways so we are about to go to kfc so i can get her like some potato wedges she don't like the mashed potatoes and gravy she likes the potato wedges so i'm just gonna you know just feed her things throughout the day so she can be full, you know, by tonight or whatever the case may be. She doesn't like the baby food, so we're not going to even worry about that. But, yeah. Come speak to the people, Brazzy. Say hey, everybody. <laughs> Say hello. Hey. Say hello. But, yeah, so this is pretty much what the blog is going to be about. Um, getting her ready for her surgery and i don't know i don't know what to expect because they're giving her they're going to put her to sleep that's one and i you know i understand the situation because how can you cut on a baby's tongue while they're up and honey she she don't want you in her mouth taking nothing out of her mouth when she don't supposed to have it like all that type of stuff she fights so i get that but it's a little scary too and then they're going to give her iv while she's sleep and take it out before she wakes up but um they won't let us back there while they're having a surgery so that's that um but it's okay because we're gonna be ready we're gonna be ready for you to come back um out after the surgery um yeah yeah okay cool, cool. but yeah so we about to go you want some potato wedges mm. what the matter what the matter okay okay mommy okay <laughs> But yeah, let's go get these potato wedges. Don't hit me. No, don't take your bow off. Ah, stop it. She's sleepy and she's actually not feeling good, which I'll mention this to them as well. She has like a little cold. Um, her nose has been runny. She has been stopped up and runny and um coughing. And I'm not sure if that plays an effect in the surgery or what they would do with that, but I wouldn't mention it to them. But she's she's been dealing. Y'all can hear her breathing. And I might suction her out. I try not to do it so much, but she hates it. Um, I do I do the baby boogie spray, suctioning out her nose. I even like did the um squeezing a little water in her nose, and it actually came out. It works, but she don't like it. And it, but you know she don't like it. So, anyways, I might let her take a nap first, and then we go get this um wedges. So I'm gonna see what she do, and then we'll go from there. Mm. Well, y'all can tell how how it's about to go now. Okay, y'all. So, KLC don't even have um the potato wedges no more. 
they have the french fries so i got her the fries what's wrong what you see mm -hmm. i got her stop it <laughs> i got her the french fries um and we gonna we over here part eating because i gotta go pick up my sister and i'm not about to go back to the house and i know when i go over there we're gonna get to talking so here Yeah, I'm gonna get to talking and this and that and stuff. So we eating in the car. Is it good, poo poo? Nobody told you to get like that. <laughs> this chicken is horrible. <laughs> you want your juice? All right, y'all. This her little last bottle. Before 12 o'clock, it's like 11.40 something, but yeah, so you better enjoy enjoy that bottle. You better get the second. All right, she's just looking. Yeah, you, you better enjoy that because that's your last one until your surgery. And I put some rice in it, so hopefully that'll make her, um, Hopefully that would last longer, make her full. Like I said, she don't be hungry through the night. She just wants the milk. She just wants to be latched on. Why are you kicking me? Stop kicking me. You're making the camera roll. But yeah, so I had got her like one of those little baby um, meals that you can get at Walmart and warm it up. And it was like the mashed potatoes and gravy with the carrots so i kind of mashed it up and gave it to her she ate some of it so this well that with the milk you better drink it that with the milk should do something so we'll see but i'm not trying to go to sleep right now she took a long nap earlier so she's not either as you can tell but um whenever she go to sleep i take the nap and then we'll go from there so let me set this alarm for um four so we can get up and get ready and then we're leaving out at 4 30. Brazi, you better drink this milk. Drink your milk. Brazi. Brazi. All right. She gonna learn the hard way. Only drunk an ounce. She's going to learn the hard way because she's not latching on to me tonight. Brazi. Okay. Ignore me. Here, get your milk. 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 Tell the people how you, <laughs> how you feel. <laughs> Man, they been missing my baby. This is 
funny. They took it. <laughs> oh, poo poo. We waiting. So she talking now, y'all. Say it again. Say it again. Say it again. She's just smiling at me. Say it again, boo boo. What you say? What you talking about? Yeah. Ooh, what? So we made it back, and that was the longest process ever. I don't even know what to call that, but the longest and like hurtful thing to watch is you know her crying and yelling and it ain't really much that we can do to comfort her um you know i'm not sure what she crying because of, they say it was the anesthesia is the reason why they got him crying but i don't i really don't think so like she was really crying like she was in pain so yeah you hitting the camera yeah i ain't say do all of this poo poo but she was really like crying like she was in pain or whatever. So I did give her some more Tylenol. And then um, I guess once that kicked in, she kind of went to sleep. And she she slept the whole ride back home. And then we got home and got something to eat. That's when she woke up and, you know, cried just a little bit. Not as 
tense, not as much. And then, um, so it wasn't as tense or as much. And then you can't have that. And then um, we took us a nap. I'm not sure how long we've been asleep, but there was some good nap and good sleep. But um, yeah, she's a little better. She did start drinking on the bottle. Or at first, she just could it. I guess it was a bad feeling to her, or it was it was a different feeling to her, and she didn't like it. I'm not sure if it was hurting when she was trying to drink or whatever. But she did drink the juice. Um, she did drink a good bit of the juice. And then now she just, you know, made her little talking sound. So that's good. Uh, hopefully she'll be, you know, even better by the end of the day and tomorrow. And yeah, but I'm still going to, um, you know, show her improvement. But that was tough earlier. And we were sleepy and it was tough. y'all so this is what like two days later and we are back to reality she's back to daycare and i'm going back to work so we're closing out this vlog thank y'all so much for watching um thank you to all the nurses and the doctor dr die um that did our surgery thank you thank you thank you she is doing good she's back to her normal self and we're gonna see how this speech thing goes um later on but thank you so much um for catching it for catching her tongue tie and um yeah so everything worked out fine like i said we're back to work she's back to daycare and here we go we're gonna see how she do at daycare today but we are back to reality but anyways thank you guys so much for watching this video and we'll see y'all in the next vlog bye